collected a few India stones and decided to make a video about using a Shipoko router to machine a sharpening jig for woodworking tools. I acquired the stones secondhand and they were badly dished, however using a flat spot of cement and a bit of effort I managed to grind them true again. With the stones flattened, I modeled them in SOLIDWORKS and designed a base plate that fit on a scrap of plywood I happened to have handy. The pockets were corner relieved so I could chew them out with a quarter inch end mill on a Shipoku HDM router. Each pocket was designed so that the tops of the different size stones would all sit level. I created a few pocket features for the stone recesses and a boss feature for the outer profile. I applied a roughing tool path to the recesses and a contour to the profile. Cutting parameters are annotated on screen. Here, I'm machining the base plate on the CNC. The HDM is a fantastic machine, the linear rails and ball screws are very rigid, and it chews through plywood with ease. I've also had great results in aluminum, but that's a topic for a dedicated video. I also use the router to cut out a block of wood for the strop. I'll glue a piece of leather to it and charge it with buffing compound to get very sharp edges on my tools.
Now, it's finally time to sharpen some tools. The stones drank a lot of oil, but I finally got a puddle to accumulate for floating off the metal shavings. I'm using a freehand technique, finding the correct bevel angle by feel. For plain irons, a slight camber is desirable to avoid making sharp gouges in a flat workpiece. To achieve that camber, I'm following a method that places five points along the edge of the iron and taking a certain number of strokes at each point, as shown in the annotations on screen. After getting the plane dialed in, it was super sharp and could take very wispy shavings. I had no problem planing a piece of lumber perfectly square. It was even sharp enough to cut red cedar end grain, which might be the subject of a future video.